What's up people of the internet? It's Paris here with yet another video. In this video we'll be testing the Intel Celeron N2840 which is a CPU based on the Silvermount architecture and part of the Bayer family of power efficient processors. It has two cores and two threads and it has a frequency of up to 2.58 GHz. The Celeron N2840 has the Intel HD graphics Bayer as the integrated graphics which have four unified shaders and a frequency of up to 1000 in H2 MHz in the the N2840's case. It's also based on the Intel HD4000's architecture while using the latest graphics suite available. You also have 4GB of RAM in single channel mode as well as a slow hard drive for the operating system and an external one on which the game is installed. As for operating system while using Windows X Lite Optimum 10 Pro version 2. All the specs are in the video description. The game that will be benchmarking today is Scrubble Space Program. I have almost no idea how to play it, but shout out to the person who requested it still. Thank you very much for the patience. Aww. We're gonna be running the memory ducked up before watching the game and I've tested to clean the RAM once the usage reaches 90%. And let's get straight to the points now.
I'm gonna show you guys how to get a little bit more FPS in this game. So, go to your game directory where you find the settings.cfg file. Yeah, the config file is literally located in the game folder. Open it with Notepad. Now, there isn't much you can lower or disable here that is actually graphics related, except for these two values here, which control the resolution. Important note, if you lower the resolution too much, the interface will become far too large, thus making the game completely unplayable. I found out that 800x600 is the lowest resolution that you should go for to avoid making the UI too large. So no super low resolutions today, okay? Anyway, let's see the result at 800x600.